You can also find plenty of politics out here at the Minnesota State yeah, Fair. Yeah, and that's a subject our Pat Kessler certainly knows a lot about. And Pat is here. He joins us now from the fair. Hey, Amelia, you know, this is low tech and retro here at the Minnesota State Fair, but there is no secret why politicians come here. No doubt this is where all of the people are. No matter what your politics. <laughs> There's a place for it at the State Fair. At the State DFL booth, fairgoers can plug the holes in health care with bean bags. People are worried because they're fearing that they're going to lose their health care if they lose their job, um, the, the costs are skyrocketing, and they're really tired of the status quo. Health care ain't beans for Republicans either. The state party is offering $2,500 cold cash to the person who can stand in line the longest. They say it's good practice for the president's health care reform plan. That's a sizable amount of money, but this is a very serious issue, and we're trying to find a way to, to discuss it and to provide a political context to it and kind of visualize to people what a government-run health care system will be like waiting in long lines for rationed health care. For more than a century, the fair's been a place for presidents and future presidents. Coolidge, Harding, Taft, Eisenhower, and Rough Rider Teddy Roosevelt, who made history here. Well, he had his famous speech. Walk softly and carry a big stick. Good to see you. What are you taking up? If he's not a future president, he's a possible future candidate for president. Governor Tim Pawlenty made the rounds. If you're going to run for president, you got to be famous, wealthy, or have a shtick. I have none of that. So I'm just here to uh, serve my state and be governor and help my party where I can. And maybe that's the shtick right there. <laughs> <laughs> the absence of a shtick. Yeah. So I think Governor Pawlenty now has shtick on a shtick. Governor Pawlenty <laughs> making the rounds here at the State Fair. Can you believe that? $2,500 to stand in line, Frank and Amelia, starting on Monday. I wonder how many people they're going to get. Yeah, that's a lot of dough. That was interesting. And the uh, Teddy Roosevelt thing was interesting as well, Pat. So uh, thank you for all of that. You bet.